I'm Amy. I'm living in Chrysalis. What's going on there? What could that be? There's a big yellow ball in the sky. All right, let's get to it. Welcome or welcome back. Yes, I'm actually filming in daylight. Why? Because I have places to go and I want to look cute today for no particular reason, just because I do. So I'm going to go ahead and go into my iconic New York collection, Downtown Cool, by Laura Geller, a TJ Maxx find. I think it paid maybe uh, maybe eight bucks for it, maybe ten. I threw out a bunch of the boxes when I was cleaning because I'm smart like that. I don't know. But what's the fun of shopping at TJ Maxx if I can't show off my, uh, my purchases besides? Let's see if this is worth stocking TJ Maxx for. Of course, if you haven't already, there is a call to action. Make sure to subscribe, like, share, comment make things happen here. I, I actually really like talking to people in the comments. It's so much fun for me. So I'm really interested to see what you're going to think of this look. I'm going to go with this middle row here. They do have names, but they're on the back, which is kind of annoying. So the middle row, we've got row, roll, row, middle row. We've got navy, gilded bronze, brick, and Sahara. So I think it's pretty self-evident this time around which they are. Shoo! I'm going to go ahead and use Sahara as my, as I guess we're going to call it the base layer. I'm going into my... Sorry, I thought to spare you from my belches, I just jammed down a quick bowl of fruit salad I made yesterday. It's lovely. I'm going to go ahead and go into Sahara, which is kind of a neutral, neutrally, cooly, taupish color. And use my Ellen Tracy Fake Artiste brush to just really lay this down as a real base layer here. There we go. I think with this palette I thought I was I figure I'll do across rows and then maybe I'll do trios down and just kind of play with the layout. The whole color story concept is still kind of new to me. I was a single singles user for a very long time, so I'm really having fun kind of playing with with layout and see where things go with it. I'm gonna go ahead and go into brick here and use another brush from that set. The set was five dollars. Five dollars, jeez. Well, well, my husband's from Brooklyn, so while well, I do not necessarily speak Brooklynese, I pick up a, a few things from him. Although probably the thing he says the most that just drives me out of my skull and I really hate it is when he says, Will you do me a salad? Like, are you talking about a number two? I can do plenty of those, but I don't think you're going to want it. I hate that so much, and I really wish you would stop. But after 10 years, I, I think I'm just going to be doomed with it. The thing I really like about this brush is you see how neat it makes it? It's almost cut creasy, not quite, but might save on concealer bells. And I'm going to go into the navy. Kind of play around with that a bit. All right, maybe a little more navy. Let's kind of pack it on there. Dang it, I didn't actually intend to wing that all the way out. 
this time. A lot of times I do, but not always. I do kind of want to sort of merge it with the brick shade, but not entirely. Because navy and brick, I don't really see how they would bl blend so well together. But this is why we try new things, kids. Besides, I thought just using the navy as an eyeliner was a, would be a bit of a cop-out for this. In regular real life, sure, but this isn't regular real life. This is Beautube! Blend, 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 blend my life away. I'm just slap happy today, I don't know. Weird sleeping hours still. Okay. Do I need a little, I think I need a little bit more of this brick here. It's maybe toward the outside here. To just sort of meld. Eh, I guess it's just going to be higher than I intended, like it or not. Is it at least fairly evenish? Not particularly. Okay. So where we go in and make corrections, people. Correction, correction, correction. Okay. I have no idea what I'm doing here. I don't know what little tunes I'm singing or buzzing or whatever. And... Oh, look, okay, yeah, some pants are... What else is new? I swear, it's like my eyeballs are the Manhattan transfer station. I'm kidding, is it Manhattan transfer a... a like a acapella jazz sort of thing. Acapella jazz is not really my scene. It's funny, this says blending concealer. I don't think I've ever used it to blend concealer. Use it to blend eyeshadow. All right. The last shade in this little quad here is just a nice gold. So, or bronze, excuse me. Gilded bronze. So, use some gilded bronze there. And see how we do. Okay, this is, this is a relatively simple look, but I'm dressed relatively simple today, so I think that might work. I'm going to go do the things. So what do you think? This almost seems, and probably it's because I've been doing quite extravagant looks on my channel, but uh, it seems normal, <laughs> almost. So what do you think? Is this a good sort of casual day look? I hope so, because that's what I've got going. That's why I'm wearing a sheer lipstick rather than a, uh, this is actually mixed with a Burt's Bees one. I threw on the Burt's Bees earlier when I couldn't find this guy, but this is the Lipstick Queen Bete Noir Possessed in Sheer. Also a TJ Maxx find. And they had this color in, oh, let's see. I think just a cream. They had it in a metal, but I'd already purchased the share and I'm not going to buy two or three different finishes in the same color. The share is very pretty, especially for warmer weather when you just kind of want to look a little bit less done. Not entirely less done, but just a little. Anyway, let me know what you think of the look. 
And of course, if you haven't already, subscribe. Please subscribe. Thank you so much, and I'll see you soon.